My name is Inma Simancas Martin, and I am a second year student at the Communication Science and Disorders program at NCCU, and I'm from the Canary Islands, Spain. So I first came to the United States in 2013, and uh, I was in a cultural inter-exchange program. So I lived with a host family in Durham. So they were the ones who first talked to me about NCCU. The grandfather had graduated from NCCU and also my host parents. And uh, they were they were the ones that encouraged me to, to stay in the state to stay in the States and continue my education here. So after I finished with this year um, of like cultural exchange, I ended up going to Fable Tech for the speech language pathologist assistant program. And I met uh, my professor there who had graduated also from NCCU. So she kind of like first, she was the first one to talk to me about the communication science and disorders program at NCCU. She was an extraordinary speech pathologist, a role model for me. So I, I really wanted to follow her steps. Um, and then after I graduated there from Fayetteville Tech, I ended up working as a speech pathologist assistant for a company in Durham that was also owned by a speech pathologist that graduated too from NCCU. So I just kept hearing wonderful things about this program. And then when I was ready to continue my education, I just knew that I wanted to do it here at NCCU. So that's where I applied and I ended up um, being accepted. And now I'm almost finished with my master. <laughs> that was one of the things that I really liked about NCCU. I, I remember the the host grandfather in this host family. He told me many stories about his years in school and he told me all about the history and the values the school had. So it really resonated with me and uh, I just like fell in love with, with everything. Uh, and uh, I knew that that's where I wanted to, to get my master's. One of these uh, open doors uh, sessions in the, my university where I did my undergraduate in Spain and I just heard the, the speech pathology program giving like a little um, speak about the, the, the speech pathology field and, uh, and I don't know, I just like knew it like, like, huh, that's me, that's what I want to do. So I just like, uh, it was something like I, I already knew from, from, some, from before. So I just went for it and I ended up loving it. And, and that's what my, my passion is and what I want to continue to, to do for the rest of my life. So I have received a great education especially in the medical field, the medical aspect of the speech pathology, which I was lacking um, in, in Spain. This area, the medical speech pathology field is not as developed and as advanced as it is here. So I am very grateful that I'm learning all of these things and it have prepared me for all my internships. So, so next I want to work in a hospital hospital and I want to to have um, to gain expertise and once I have all of this knowledge under my my belt I hope to to create my own educational um, company or 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 my my own um, yeah my company so I can uh, share all of this um, experience and uh, and also there is a lot of research and guidelines here in the United States that we don't have available in Spain. So I want to be able to create maybe some courses, online courses, and eventually uh, be able to teach all of this that I'm learning here to Spanish um, speech pathology in Spain, so they can also practice uh, at the top of their license as, as we do here. So it has been a, a beautiful experience. <laughs>